Project Diary Day 1. What we got here then, Tom? Oh, uh, it's my engine. What sort of engine well, is it? It's the D. It is, isn't it? It was very kindly given to you by Mr. Rose, wasn't it? Yeah. And what are you planning to do with this engine, Tom? Make it work. Make it work. Fantastic. Can you tell me what you're doing at the moment? I'm just scraping all the rock off of it to see how much paint it's still got left on it. Right, that's very good. Are we planning perhaps to keep it in its original paint if there's enough left on it then? Yeah, so we're planning to perhaps keep it in its working clothes. I'll just come round this side, show you what Tom's doing. What you're using to scrape it with there, Tom? A stick. A stick, a piece of wood. We just put like a chisel edge on the piece of wood, haven't we? Yeah. So hopefully we don't damage the paint that's left on. This is Tom's first day working on his engine. We've looked up the serial number. We uh, believe the engine is 1941 in date. How many engines have you restored, Tom? Um, is this your first one? I think it might be. I think it is, isn't yeah, it? Yeah. And we like engines, don't we? Yeah. Old vintage engines. There's quite a lot of paint left on there, isn't there, Tom? Mm. Lots of muck and oil. Yeah. Right, we'll come back to Tom's engine later. Diary number two, see how he's getting on. Are you going to put this on YouTube? Here we are, an hour and a half later. And Tom is still hard at it. What are you up to now then, Tom? I'm just cleaning it up with some wipe spirit and seeing how much paint we've got left on it. Fantastic. Let's have a little look at what he's been up to. Oh, Tom scraped a lot of the grime and oil off just with a uh, stick really with an end shaped a bit like a chisel. Good work that Tom. Incidentally Tom's only nine him green away there. It's his first engine. Enjoying it Tom? Yeah. It's really fun. Can we come around that side and have a look what you've been doing? Okay. So what problems have we got with this engine, Tom, that we know of? Well, it doesn't go anywhere. It doesn't go anywhere? Yeah. What do we mean by that? The, the flywheel seized up. That's right, the engine seized up, isn't it? So yeah. I think we're going to have to dismantle it, aren't we? Yeah. Well, we've just been giving it a good clean first. So Tom's been giving it a good clean. a lot better than when we started or than when Tom started I keep saying we I've not done anything I've been pruning and trimming and clearing up in the garden it's all Tom's work well we've got to go out in a minute so we're going to do some more later on this afternoon then Tom yep and we start taking some bits off it do you think yeah okay well we'll uh, Perhaps film some of that and do another video blog so you can see where Tom's uh, got to with his dismantling. Thanks for watching. Bye. You can say bye, Tom. Bye.
Hello. It's me again. Good luck, Tom. This is our second session today yeah. of Tom working on his list of D. Now he's given it a good clean. We've scraped, or well, Tom has scraped lots of the muck and oil off, and now he's going to start dismantling it. So, what, what, do you, what are you going to take off first then, Tom? Okay, we're going to have a look in here to see if there's any oil in it. Right, okay. Well, that was nice and loose. Let's have a look what we've got in there, Tom. There's nothing oh. in it, so we need to. No oil, just rust. Mmm, could possibly explain why this engine is seized up, maybe. Wow, so, oh, I don't know what I'm doing with this camera. I'm zooming right in there. So I'm going to have to zoom back out again. There we go. Novices, eh? Uh, so, what are we going to do then, Tom, now? So, now we're going to start dismantling the eight pieces. Yeah. And clean it up inside. Yeah, we'll start dismantling it, aren't we? Yeah. 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 See if we can find out why it's seized up. Yeah. So, we're going to get cracking. And I think what we'll do is, once Tom started to get some bits off, we'll do another little film. Now, hopefully, if we've got people out there that have restored a list of these, um, please feel free to leave comments, helpful tips and advice, and, and subscribe to Tom and his list of D restoration. We'll catch you later. Hey, we'll say bye, Tom. Bye, people. Right, we're back with Tom and his Lister. Hello. And as you can see, we've actually managed to do quite a little bit of dismantling. Uh, we, we've been relegated to the corner of the yard, uh, so his mummy can get through. But uh, we've been, you've been quite busy, haven't you, Tom, this afternoon? Yeah, yeah, busy and busy, yeah. Uh, yeah, so what can you tell us so far about this engine then? So, so we've taken it apart, got the flywheel, Still doesn't move. Nope. So unfortunately, it's still seized up, isn't and it? This bit doesn't move. Yeah. Oh. Well, that's the governor, isn't it? Yeah. And that's um, the governor assembly is all seized up at the moment. Yeah, we've taken the chain off and the. Um, Let's have a look what we've got in here. Tom's got lots of bits in his box here. He's been putting them all in envelopes and labelling them up. Let's come around here now. It's just got to work, he says. Now he's got a lot of work, I, I think, is what we ought to say. But we've got the cylinder head off. Doesn't look too bad. I was showing you the cylinder head gasket here. Yes, there we go. I think we'll be replacing that, Tom, aren't we? Yeah. So we've got the cylinder head down here. That looks like it's going to be okay. Um, so far, got the head off. We've uh, tried having a gentle wallop at the piston with a piece of uh, wood uh, just to protect it and then uh, using the engineer's hammer that we've got down there and of course nothing's moving at all at the moment and here we are this, this is what we have to contend with when we're working mummy no, coming no, through don't. Uh, no don't there we go there's mummy so here we are so i think that's it for today we've, we've just lit a barbecue i'm getting very hungry uh, Tom, I think, would probably work right through the night because he's really enjoyed himself with his first engine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, so we're going to say goodbye and please like and follow and all the rest. And uh, I think it'll likely be next weekend before we do any more. So we'll do another uh, little film to show you how Tom's getting on. Uh, and again, if you've got any useful suggestions, tips and advice on how we proceed, then please feel free to comment. Uh, thank you very much for watching. Bye, Bye for now. Bye.